Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Brian's Badass Reviews. That's me, I'm Brian, and I am on a first time ever beard journey. And on this channel, what I do is I'm showing off products that have helped me along the way. In today's video, I'm gonna go to one of my OG beard products that I used when I first started trying to get some scruff on this face. We're gonna talk about Amist Amish. So let's get into it. Kick the intro. Hey, what the hey is going on everybody? Welcome back to Brian's Badass Reviews. Thanks so much for stopping back in and spending some time with me today. Hey, if you like this content, I hope you'd consider hitting the subscribe button and get that video a like. Don't forget to hit the bell notification so that you see my future content coming out. In today's video, I wanna talk about one of the very first beard products that I ever used on this little scruffy beard of mine. And that company is called Honest Amish. I ran into Honest Amish over at the uh, Wally World, what I like to call Wally World, and uh, I saw it there on the shelf and I had to pick myself up a, a can of it. And so Honest Amish, they're a company that's been around for a long time, right? They started off in flea markets and were one of those companies that kind of made it big and got to be into some of these big box companies across the country. One of the great things about Honest Amish is you don't have to wait for it. It's not like you have to order it online and wait for it to come in your mailbox. You can run out right to your local store. It's probably sitting there right now. They got beard balms, they got oils, they got soaps, they got socks. They got all kinds of different products and you can find them locally and that's what's cool about them Now I'll put a link in the description below so you don't have to go out locally because for me Sometimes I get afraid to go out to our local Wally world. It gets a little bit creepy there sometimes This is the honest Amish beard balm and I think you can pick this up for right around $13 and it's really good stuff These guys use all kinds of natural ingredients just like we like here on this channel and they're using all kinds of natural oils natural natural butters natural um, like nuts and organic. It's all organic, not tested on animals, all of that kind of stuff. This stuff is the beard balm. Of course, you put you get your beard oil in and get it down to the skin. And of course, the beard balm is more for the styling. Now, I picked up the first can and I tried it and I liked it. And it's a very, I don't know if you can see it there, but it's this is a very soft, it's not hard to get out of the can. Nothing like that. You don't have to scrape it off with a pick like you do some of the other companies, but it's just a very soft, nice beard butter so you get yourself out about a fingernail size of it right put it in the hand and it melts down in the hand very nice very quick you can see how it it glistens there just like a lot of these other beard butters and beard balms and stuff like that this one has star of anise in it so it does have that black licorice smell if you're not a fan of that black licorice smell this may not be the stuff for you but you they have all kinds of unscented stuff they have they have different uh scents profiles as well so you just get yourself some out of there get it in the beard and it does a really nice job of just conditioning the beard. Um, I would say as far as the styling and hold, it would be probably a medium hold. What it does is, is as far as feeling beard, it's nice and soft. It conditions it. It kind of keeps it nice and moisturized throughout the day. Um, so it's a very good product. That's just the regular old fashioned beard balm from, from Honest Amish. I wanted something with a little bit more hold. So I noticed that they did have this heavy duty and I think I got this on Amazon. If, if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure I, I looked them up on Amazon picked up a can of this now this one is a heavy duty and this is the unscented so what i like about this is i can wear whatever beard oil i want to wear and then i can smack this stuff in and it's not gonna it's not gonna compromise with the beard oil that i put in so same kind of consistency again it's kind of a soft balm so it comes out real easy real nice but this one does have a little bit more of that styling a little bit more of that hold i'm not sure if it's got a little more beeswax in it or, or what it is that makes it um a little more heavy duty as they call it but what i do like about this because i'm not a I, I like black licorice but as far as having the scent in my beard i'm not crazy about it so the heavy duty beard balm doesn't have that black licorice it's just an unscented and it's got a nice hold it still does the moisturizing and the conditioning but it's got a little more of that stylish hold so very cool stuff honest amish now one of the knocks on these guys is like oh they got into the they're they're big time now like ooh, like you know there seems to be like two different camps like if you're a big box company that's you know that that's a, you somehow sold out what i like about these guys is they have stayed true to their word um you know same ingredients they're not cranking out any bad synthetics or anything in there um they've been around for a long time and it's quality product it's quality ingredients in there they're keeping the price down low i think it's, you can i think maybe $13.99 or something like that is the, the highest I saw for one of their beard balms. Um, but it's very good. 
I still have it on my shelf. I still use it from time to time. Of course, I have a bunch of different products out there. They even say on their website, like, we know there's a ton of different products out there. We appreciate you considering us. And again, what's great about it is you don't have to wait. You don't have to go to the mailbox. You don't have to, you know, wait for three, four days, five days for it to come in. You can run out to your local store and just pick it up right now. So this is one of the original beard balms that I started using when I was just kind of getting into this world of beard oils and beard butters and stuff like that. And I liked it. I still like it to this day. So I am behind them 100%. So go on, get yourself some. I will put a link down in the description. The stuff that they have on their website, you can find more of it on the website than you can if you do go out to the store. Usually they have maybe one or two different variety of things there, but on their website, they have all kinds of stuff. So I'll put a link down there. If you click the link and it takes you to the website it, and you purchase something off of there, it does help out the channel. You're helping out my family. I do get a little bit of a kickback on it, um, but it's like, a few cents it's nothing major and doesn't cost you anything more but so let me leave you with a question today have you tried honest amish do you like them do you love them do you not like them is it a pass let me know down in the comments go ahead and write down there i love it if you've used it and you love it are there other beard balms that you love out there that i should try go ahead and leave it down in the comments i hope this video has been helpful for you today i highly suggest honest amish i stand behind it 100 while you're down in the comments don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the like button um you gotta check these guys out I really like them, still have them on my shelf. If you run out of stuff that you're that you're using and you, you need an emergency, what's great is you can just go out and you can buy this anywhere. So, um, very good product, very good company, honest Amish. That's all I got for today, guys. You know what I always say, be kind to each other. Do what you love. I'm out, peace.